Hey buddy, I hear you like losing. Um, last time I checked, I, I last time I checked, I won. Yeah, but yeah, but I won most of them, so. Yeah, in your fucking dreams. Yeah, I beat you, motherfucker. I've beaten you more times than you think you have. This this shit box behind me could beat you in a race. That shit box will be would stall before you even get off the finish the starting line. Yeah, it'd still be better than your char challenger though. So mine's a demon, bro. On his. Yeah, mine's a demon though, bro. And look at the paint job. Yeah, look at my paint job. My challenger is fucking slick, and you know it. Just, just yeah, accept sure it. Yeah, just accept it. Look, no, look at this. You accept it, man. Look at this mixture. That is a perfect ass mixture. Why'd you put uh, oil in your coolant tank again? <laughs> you know I've never done that, motherfucker. <laughs> See? Listen to that. That is a beast. All right. You wanna hear- okay, you wanna hear that? Open headers, motherfucker. I just took down your fence and sprayed you with dirt. Not in my eyes, that last bit. Destroyed my fucking fence. What the fuck you on, mate? What'd you break my fence down for? Dude, you broke my fence. Nah, that's some bullshit. You broke my fence. No, you broke your, my fence. Anyway, it, yeah, stop breaking my fence. I'm going to get some oil. Fuck yeah. Add new oil to the mixture. Mm mm mm. Wait. What the fuck? Did you fucking stab my tire, you prick? Dude, I was inside, man. Fucking I stab my tire. We had that discussion. I didn't stab nothing. Fucking stab my tire again, I'll shoot you. I'll shoot you. Touch my fucking car, motherfucker. What <coughs> the fuck was that? He <laughs> closing the screen door. <laughs> I love the way we use we have these nice ass cars, like hundred thousand dollar cars, but we live in these fucking shit, shit holes. for houses. <laughs> That's some legit bullshit. Right. <laughs> We wanted to save money for our car. <laughs> the fuck are you whinging at now? Fucking honestly, up, neighbors. Fucking, fucking hell. The fuck do you want? I'm trying to sleep, you motherfucker. I'm trying to go to work. You slashed my fucking tires, man. Don't be fucking. You you slashed my tires. I don't know what you're on about. Look at my foot. Look at my tire. I don't know what you're talking about either. I didn't slash your tires. Yeah, you totally did. Look at that. It's a knife mark right in the side. You didn't even let it down. You pop. You you burst it. So fuck you. I don't have a knife on me. Yeah, bullshit. Right, go yeah, fucking. Why would you frisk me? Go in your scraggly ass car to your scraggly ass work. Get a real job. I'm going back to my shithole trailer. Why'd you go? Hey, are you fucking kidding me? You f fucker! Oh, hold on, hold on. Bear with me. Bear with me. Bear with me. Oh nope, that didn't work. Nope, that didn't work either. There we go. The fuck's all that noise about? So loud out here. Jesus Christ. What the fuck? That's right. That's it. You see the uh, glass chunk in the in your mirror windshield? Yep. Hey, what the? Oh shit! Are you fucking kidding me? Oh no. Okay. Fucking asshole. What is this, Algonquin or is this Chola? <laughs> this is Algonquin. I just fell through my own chair. Oh, this is Algonquin? Oops. 
Yeah, don't worry about it. Hey, hey, man. Come, come have a look at this. Uh, sir, were you the caller? R. No, I didn't call shit, but look at that. He put his foot right through my windscreen and stabbed my tire. He's also put rocks through the window of my house and tried to steal things from the side of my house, like panels and stuff like that. And then he's calling the police on me. Oh, wow, yeah, you are missing a windshield. Yeah, and he stabbed my tire here. I'll admit, I broke his window, but motherfucker smashed my car. I spent $120,000 on this car. And he's just yeah, sour. What's up with these? He, yeah. He's sour because I beat him in a race. It looks like bullet holes, but what what are the four marks there? Just above your wheel well. Do you see that? Um, I'm not really sure. I don't know. Perhaps he shot my car, this prick. I don't know. I was in bed when it happened. I was in bed. Okay. I came out. I confronted him. Did I stabbed him. Did you hear any gunshots? Wheel. No, I didn't. And I went back in, and I come back out two minutes later, and his foot has gone through my windscreen. Okay. Did you see his? Did you see him doing any of the damage? He admitted it to me. And when I came okay. out, he was running away okay. from my car. Okay. And what's your name? My name's Mike McIntosh. <laughs> Okay, Mr. McIntosh. You don't have any weapons or anything on you, anything crazy, right? No, I chucked the crowbar over there, but other than that, no. Oh, I got my 50 cal on okay. me as well. You have it on you? Yeah, it's in my waistband. I wouldn't take any chances with this asshole. Okay. I tell you what, since since we're here now, if you don't mind, just put it in your house uh, and clearing it while we're here. If anything happens, obviously we're here. We'll take care of it, so we don't need you to have your weapon on you right now. Okay? Yeah, I'll go right away for you. Look! Look at that! He smashed my windows, that. asshole. This one around here still has the rock holes in it, where the rock went straight through. He's like smashed every single window in my house, and he stabbed my car. That's what, what I'm really upset about. And he's pressed foot through my windscreen. Yeah. Okay. Did <laughs> Did he throw the rocks through the window while you were inside the house? Yeah, he's been throwing them at my house all night. I was putting up with it, but then he smashed Ooh, my windscreen, me. so I was just like, you know what? Fuck it, I'm gonna hit his car. Thinks he can do this okay. to me. Okay. Well, let's let's head on, on over here. I'm gonna have you stand by your car. I'm gonna go talk to the uh, the other deputy and, and, and see what, what the other individual is saying, okay? Yeah, he's probably pulling some bullshit out of his hat, like always. Well, I'm sure. I mean, there's his side, your side, and the truth somewhere in between, so... But that's why we're here, we'll figure Hopefully it all out. Hopefully they can see in our screens, if not, yeah, we'll just I point hope it so. out. Okay. What did you say? What? To the cop? I just told him, you've just utterly fucked up my car. Oh, I went a bit further than that. You, you've done quite a lot. <laughs> well, I didn't do shit. Yeah, you did. I remember seeing oh. you throwing those rocks through my window. I threw a rock at your window. No, you took out every single window in my house. I distinctly remember that happening. Oh. <laughs> do you know what? I might even go further. What are you thinking? <laughs> my God, look at my Ford Sierra. Your Fort Sierra. Yeah, that's right there, all rusty. It was brand new like two weeks ago until you let loose on it. Oh, bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, if you go that route, I'll tell them that rust bucket's been sitting there since I moved in. I was joking about that. <laughs> They're not going to believe that, obviously. Look at it. <laughs> I think it's good they're going to put dismiss it as one of those he said she said things. Yeah, and then I'm going to shoot you in the head and drive off. Seems legit. <sighs> get down, get down, get down. He can see the bullet down. holes in my car apparently from the taser. I can't see them, but apparently he does. I didn't shoot no taser. 
Yeah, you did. Oh, my tire. I have no idea what you're talking about. I didn't say that to him, but when you popped my tire, you shot over Taser, didn't you? At first. Yeah. Yeah. Well, he can see those holes, I can't. I was just like, oh, I don't know what the fuck you used to pop my tire. <laughs> I didn't pop no tire. That hole in my windscreen. I got a taser, but it's a handheld taser. That hole in my windshield looks so perfect, though. Was it? A, even though I was like a staged uh, smash? Mm-hmm. It's like a perfectly formed hole with cracks coming out of it in my eyes. <laughs> yeah, I know. I saw that. That looks pretty I sick. Was, I was actually honest about that. I was honest about hitting your car with a crowbar, though. Fucking asshole. Okay, guys. So here's what's going on: is we've got you know both sides. You guys can press charges on each other, and we can arrest you both and and take you down, or you guys can figure this out in the civil court. This is kind of like a civil matter right now. So it, it's up to you guys how you want to. What do you think, civil civil court? I mean, or arrest. Well, it's quite the predicament. Um, I don't think there's any need for any of us to get arrested. I think we can both agree on that. Let's not be completely stupid here. I agree on that. I really don't want to go back to jail. See? Felon. That's what this... He's criminal. But... Yeah, that was my past, man. Fortunately, I've got insurance. But I'm warning you now, if you come near my house one more time, 50 cal bullets to the face. Well, let's let's not let's not do that, because now we're threatening. You no, know, I, that was more of a... Property, Oh, that was just a warning. So how do you feel about right. premeditated murder? Take care. Ooh. Sorry, right, guys. Well, like, my character getting murdered? Or killed? Or severely injured? Yeah. I'm thinking... You step on my property, so I just shoot you point blank. And then like, drag... Like, even if it's just to fix the fence? So you're fixing the fence, I shoot you and drag you onto my property and there's a blood trail leading back. Oh, I've got no well, felonies on this guy, but fuck it, that's fine. So we're gonna make it obvious that you were killing me? Yeah. Do you wanna do sounds that? Sounds fair to me. I'd yeah, say, sounds fair to me. I'd say give it ten minutes or so. Yep. Yeah, while we're waiting, plan this out. So, you be fixing the fence. I will lean out from the bush by here, mm -hmm. pop you, run over, you do slash revive. Yep. I and then in <laughs> I in quotes drag your body <laughs> over to here. And I sunbathe it. Yep. I'll stand here with my gun. Yep. And claim that you ran at me with a knife. That I planted. Clear. All clear. <sighs> I'm legit nervous as fuck. Oh, you missed! Here, quick, 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 quick. Right, drag's then, body. In front of my car here. In front of my car. Right here. Boom. Oh my god, 911! <laughs> Dude, he ran at me! I had to put him down. Nah, you'd be dead, dude. I shot you in the face. Oh, really? Yeah. You are gonna, like, RP it out that you. It was, it was preemptive, right? No, I'm gonna try and get away with it. Oh, you fucker, come on! Hey, you guys alright? No, man, I had to shoot him. He was running at me with a knife. Oh, oh no, fuck that. Oh, okay. Fuck that. Right. I am. No. It's right. gonna be attempted oh. murder. Or maybe at least one Yeah, let me see if I can get away with it. Right? I had no choice, man. He was running at me with a knife. Uh, alright, alright, alright. So here, here's the deal. I'm just gonna. I'm, I just gotta put you in handcuffs for now, obviously. Um, I just patch you Obviously, down, okay, you're gonna put the dirt, the, the blood trails, off. right? Um, yeah. We'll, we'll get this all sorted out, okay? Yeah. This is this your property? Yeah, it's mine. Uh, I've got my pistol in my now waist. Now we're this location you're moving to. Uh, I've got an officer on okay. scene. I'm a, I'm a just... <laughs> okay. Alright, uh, Mr... What's your name? I'm sorry. Uh, Macintosh. Come on. Okay, alright, just sit, have a seat right here. I'll be right back with you. 
<laughs> uh, sir? He shot me, man! I was trying to fucking fix the fence! Okay, you said you ran at him with a knife. Where, where are you hurt? Oh, everywhere. And then I felt something like something slip into my pocket, man. When I was being dragged. Are you gonna... You should RP die in. Are you gonna RP die in? Oh, I'm gonna RP yeah, die. you got this nice. knife on you here. Um... I think he tried to plant it on me, man. I... I... I really okay, was... hold on, hold on. <laughs> I'm gonna kick that to the side. <laughs> you should hear me right now. I can. <laughs> oh, you can? How is there only one unit on scene? Right? Like, this is literally a murder. Dude, I was... I was trying to fix the pet. <laughs> All right, just hold on, man. Uh, was there another officer that was out here earlier? <laughs> yeah, it was a Tahoe, man. He was—he actually saw me. I think I, <laughs> he saw me trying to fix the fence, man. <laughs> okay, do you remember his name? Um, I do not. I think it was King. I think. Okay. Yeah, it was the fire brigade <laughs> and an ambulance. Oh. <laughs> Going straight past the scene. They probably got to pop a U-turn. Yeah, they are. Where? <laughs> Alright, just hold on, bud. We got uh, help coming for you. I think I watch this. <laughs> Slash me dies. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Uh, he's got multiple GS. Okay. Some debris. Uh, where uh, are just they? Just the pressure for now. Uh, all in his chest. Challengers. All in his chest. Okay. Hey. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. So, so, uh, what we got? Um, five, five, six. You're here, right? Yeah. That's yeah. Right. Yeah. Uh, one five. Supposedly, one so, five so the guy in the white shirt said, uh. That he yeah, had to shoot the bit. other guy because uh, he was running at him with uh, a knife. Can I get a hit here? Mm -hmm. Anyone else? Mm -hmm. um, okay, it's misting a little sorry, bit. Sorry, back away. Back the guy saying that he was fixing away. the fence. The, uh, the guy shot him. Yeah, stay um, the fuck dragged away. Dragged him over to this side of his his lawn and then slipped the knife in his pocket. Take your life. <laughs> um, I got him confiscated <laughs> or got him in with cuffs. I got the gun here. off of him and the knife off mm -hmm. the other guy. Uh, I'm gonna run the knife for Prince and see if. Uh, I want to stuck with the other yeah, guy that's cuffed. Yeah, I took that. The other I'm gonna wipe cuffed. the knife down. No, I'm saying, did you? No, well, I did. They, they, it's... Yeah, he I said think the that blood uh, he was over enough. here, and uh, yeah. the guy in the black just charged I'll just put knife, me... So we had to shoot him. Uh, the guy in the black was saying that he was just working on the fence. He got shot in the chest a bunch of times, and then the guy dragged him over to the right, side. I'm gonna load you and, up on uh, the stretcher here, put and we're the gonna take you to the hospital, alright? I got it. To the current location. Tough one. Where's your uh where's your vehicle at? Uh mine's the Taurus right over there. Now let's go over there. Yeah. Hi doggy. Hello. Hey, can you stay with him for a second? Yep. Hey, can uh one of you help me um, put, put him up on the structure? I didn't realize we had the canine unit. <laughs> yep. There is a dog on scene. <sighs> Alright, I got him uh, uh, bandaged up. So I, I don't know if you saw uh, the, uh, the, the blood the trail. Yeah, I got you. They, they saw the right. blood trail. One, two, three. <laughs> Dude, it, one minute he's fixing the fence, and then he just runs at me with a knife. I'm trying to fix my car. I, I had no choice, man. Okay. So you're claiming self-defense? It was 100% self-defense. I was just... I even moved my car so I wouldn't be as near to him. Okay. Well, one second for me. They're really... Oh, they're taking me to CLS! 
you're gonna die on the way there. I don't know, just keep me updated on what's going on. He's questioning me what happened. He was like, I was here five minutes ago. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> Alright, have they read you rights or, or anything like that yet? Or have they talked to you? No, they were just howling. I, I hope he survives, man, but as I said, he was either that or get stabbed to death. And I ain't taking chances. No, I, I get it. If you, I mean, if you, oh, I got a guy coming at me with a knife and I've got a gun. Don't bring a knife to a gunfight, so. <laughs> yeah, exactly. He, he he was like encroaching on my property just to try and push it. <laughs> I just so doing, I like, just kept painful moans. Like I, I right went now. in to get my gun just to be safe. <laughs> okay, Mr. McIntosh. So just real quick, I just got to read you this before I ask you any questions. Okay, so just longer. to cover my butt and cover yours. Um, so right now, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can will be used against you in court of law. You have the right to have an attorney present with you during all forms of questioning. If a foreign attorney won't be appointed to you by the state of San Andreas at no cost to you. You understand these rights in which they've been read to you? Yeah, I understand, man. Okay, that being said, would you like to answer any questions without an attorney present? Yeah, I've got nothing to hide. Okay. Alright, so you want to just walk me through one more time what happened? Um, I understand the other officers were out here earlier, so kind of just walk me through what happened after they left. Uh, to the point of where I rolled up. Um, yeah, so... He, he got a hammer out and all of his tools to start fixing the fence up. So I moved my car so I wouldn't be near him uh, to try and get it fixed up. And I was changing the oil and I leaned over my hood and he I, ju I just caught it out of the corner of my eye. He was just acting real shady off to my left. So I looked at him and he sort of came up from the crouch he was in by his tool bag and he was running at me with something in his hand and I saw it was a knife so I, I got my gun out earlier because he was acting real shady and he was coming on to my property a lot so I just I grabbed my gun and shot him man he was running at me with a knife okay um, did he say anything to you before he started running over or no he just kind of like screamed I want to describe it as he was just going ah and running at me and okay. my reflexes and just kicked which, in which hand was he holding the knife in? Uh, I'm pretty sure it was his right hand I'm not entirely sure okay um, and after you shot him did you see where the knife went? Or no I, w I really wasn't paying attention I, I took a step back and before I knew it, there was just this police car outside, so I ran over and asked for help. Okay, and how many times did you shoot him? Um, two or, or three. Uh, how many times did you pull the trigger? Two or three, I think. I've, I've never shot a okay. gun before, I've been at range, so I'm... <laughs> I, I was... my hands were shaking at the time. Okay, and the gun you got, when did you get that? I've had that for ages. I sometimes, as I say, I go to the range now and again. Uh, probably about three or four years ago, I bought this one. Okay. Can I just get your first name? I'm sorry. Yeah, it's Michael McIntosh. If there was any, I like. If I had more time, then I'd like to think I wouldn't have shot him. But it was so split second. He was either shoot him or get stabbed. Can Can you spell Macintosh for me? I'm sorry. Yes, M A C H I N T O S H. Ah, uh, okay. M Michael Julian McIntosh. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Sorry, your your ID that I got here is just a little smudged. Yeah, it's it's quite old. Okay, so we had the the knife in his right hand. Yeah. Okay, and he was just running at you with it. Uh, where were you when you shot him? Like, I was, where were you standing? Uh, in front of my car, looking at my engine. Okay, and where was he running from? Over here by the fence? Uh, by the bushes over, like, um, between my property and his. Okay. Did you see him pull the knife out, or...? I mean, 
just before it happened, he was like coming onto my property and going back onto his, like to I don't know why he was just trying to test the water, I guess. Um. Okay. Did you say anything to him when he was doing that? I told him stay on his side of the fence. That's about it. Um. Then he didn't do it again but, for. But about... you didn't call the police at all, even even after they were already out here. I, I well, thought he was sure when they came. I'm pretty sure when when they came out here the first time, they I'm sure they told both of you to stay on your own sides of the property. Yeah, like he that, he said he would fix the fence, so, so I just assumed that he was like trying to see where it went in the ground or something like that. Okay, so then when he was coming back and forth on your property, it would you would assume he was coming over just to see you know how to fix the fence. Yeah, and then as I say, he had like his tool bag over there by the bushes. And he leaned down to get me out of the bag, and I looked at him, and then he just lunged for me. So he, so he was over by the bushes. He was over by the car. Um, he were the big bush over here by the the telephone pole, like no, like by or? further back, like in line with his blue Challenger over there. Okay. And he was bent down behind the bushes? Uh, yeah. Like, behind the four new okay. prickly ones by there. And you see him, you saw him pull the knife out of his, uh, his bag there? I saw him pull something out, I wasn't quite sure what it was, but then he started running at me. And it, it just glinted off something, and that's when I knew it was a knife, so I was like, oh shit. And, as I said, I had my gun as a precaution, okay. and... I, I just pulled out on him, and I was going to tell him to stop, but he was just running at me so fast. Wait, do you keep your gun in a holster, or did you already have it out? Was it in your hand? No, it was just on my waistband. I got a holster, but it's like, uh, as you can see by the button, I had the button undone. Oh, uh, okay. Um, but were you kind of ready to go? Like, you already had your hand on the holster, like, ready for it? I was on edge, but I wasn't ready to go. Um, my hand was by my side. Because, okay, because I mean that 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 distance there from like the bushes where you're explaining to your car is an extremely short distance to the point of where you know I, I would assume he would have been able to stab you a couple times before you even got your gun out of the holster. You know, <sighs> there, there's there's been multiple studies that someone can cross at least 26 feet charging full speed with a knife before you can actually draw the gun out of your holster. Um, and that's what trained professionals who are trained to shoot and draw firearms out of out of holsters. Um, um, it kind of just seems like you, you might be, you know, kind of pulling my leg here. I, you know? I don't know what to say. Maybe um, the bushes slowed him down or something. But as I said, my hand was by my side. Okay, but so, so, I so, guess I got the draw on him. Okay. So so. Are you able to ex just quickly explain? So there's a trail of blood going from where his body was all the way back over to uh, almost the other side to his yard, um, as well as you know all the dirt is all kicked up there. Uh, all the blood is kind of mixed in with it. Uh, know anything about that? Um, maybe blood splatter. I mean, all the dirt being mixed I mean, up. That's probably from his feet where he was trying to lunge for me. What? Well, yeah, but that wouldn't explain how the blood got mixed in with it, you know? It, it must be blood splatter. I mean, I'm I'm not an expert like you guys, but... It, it must have come out... I don't know, I mean, but did the bullet go straight through him, or... I, I don't know. It, it, it didn't seem like that. Um, I'm going I'm to tell you what, I'm pretty sure and think what happened... Um, and we're gonna obviously test this further and present it all to you in court. But I'm I'm pretty sure what happened was he was on the other side of the fence. I don't know whether he's antagonizing you or not, but I think you shot him while he was on the other side of the fence, dragged his body over this side, and stuffed the knife in his pocket. No. Um, I was the one who patted him down. I found the knife in his pocket. You're telling me he had the knife in his hand. You're telling me after you shot him, he went and st put the knife back into his pants pocket? Instead of just dropping it where it was, he, he um, must have. Like he was still alive, so. You know, you, you're telling me, you're telling me he's charging at you with a knife in his right hand, but he's over there telling me that he's a lefty. Well, um, I'm, you know, I'm why, not why sure which hand his knife your, was your in. We can to. 
You know, uh, now you're not sure which hand this knife is in. No, I'm pretty like sure this is right, but I'm you, not 100%. You the, and you clearly saw the knife in his hand. I saw something glint. Like. Okay, well, I'm, well here's what I'm going to tell you right now. Um, so right now you're going to be placed under arrest for attempted murder and aggravated battery with a weapon. Um, I'm going to take you down to uh, county. I'm going to get you booked up or whatever. And they'll get you set up with an arraignment date. Uh, we're going to test the fingerprints Fuck. on the knife um, and see if his fingerprints are even on the knife. Because uh, I'm going to tell you right now, you know, knives uh, made of metal, especially the handle too on that one. I mean, um, if, if I was going to plant the knife, why, there was, why would I put it in his pocket? That doesn't make sense. That, I, I get what you're saying, but it doesn't make sense either way. I, I don't know why the knife was in well, his pocket. Well, I mean, you, you, don't, you don't seem like the... Uh, you don't seem like the murderous, uh, you know, crime lord type, you know? It was probably your first murder. I wouldn't expect you to get everything right. It, it was my first self-defense. I mean, I once punched a kid in the face well, in school because he came at me, but that's about it. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm gonna help you over to my cruiser. It's the, uh, the, tor the sheriff chores just right behind you. Like I said, you know, if this was a def self-defense shooting, um, which I'm Unfortunately, I don't, I don't believe it is. Um, I think I have enough to go Fuck. on here. Uh, you know, you have your day in court. We'll decide then. Uh, you know, you'll be able to, uh, to prove your case. And DA will prove ours. And uh, we'll go from there, okay? Uh, but I'm gonna help you walk over to my... And we'll, uh, we'll get you all set, okay? Yeah, hopefully I can clear my name. Alright, just watch your head. I'm gonna just grab the door for you. I'm under arrest. Are you dead? Yep. Yeah, my character's in a coma. He's gonna be in a seven-day coma. Nice. <laughs> Why did you say the knife was in your pocket? That doesn't make sense. That's the, I didn't say there was a knife in my pocket. I said it felt flipped into my pocket. He just said knife. Why would I put it in your pocket? <laughs> that doesn't make oh, any that. sense. As he said it to me, I was like... Wait, that doesn't make sense either way. Maybe... I wasn't thinking anyways. Yeah, and he was bleeding. <laughs> I hope I you die, just, you I, I should've animal. just dropped it. I should've just dropped it. Yeah, that would've made much more sense. Okay, but I guess we weren't... I guess none of us was thinking that. I that assumed it was thing. obvious, but... <laughs> yeah, but... But I guess it was just more of an impromptu... It was just more of an on-the-spot, trying-to-hustle-it thing. Yeah. Yeah, well, I'm, 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 I say that was a successful scenario. Yeah, I'm going to jail. <laughs> attempted murder. Suck it. Attempted murder and battery with a weapon or whatever, something like that. Assault with a deadly weapon. No, it was it was battery with a weapon, I think. But yeah, he hmm. didn't seem to believe my side. <laughs> right. Suck it. He's gonna come back now. Is he gonna say anything or just start driving? Are you guys heading back to the station right now? Yep. Right, I guess I don't need to show anymore, so thank you guys so much for watching. Um, make sure you're staying inside during these tough times all around the world. Oh, fuck yeah. I, we yeah. forgot to mention that in the other videos. Uh, Corridor Crew, I don't know if you've ever heard of them, a YouTube channel. They did an amazing video about why it Was spread that? so fast. You broke, you broke up. Corridor Crew is a YouTube channel. They did an amazing video about why it spread so fast. Um, mm -hmm. So I would highly recommend that. I'm not plug in. They're not sponsoring me or anything. All right, but sir. Just watch your handle. Well, I'll check them out. out. Um, other than that, thank you guys so much right. for watching. Thanks Dang. for burping. And, and I'll hey, see you all want, next time. Well, a couple hey, things actually as well. Need two minutes just to get them booked up. Oh, oh. Sheriff. Hello. Yeah, yeah go ahead. All right. Uh, okay, I was gonna say. Uh, um, right don't forget to check out Nick's Discord as well. <laughs> yeah, don't yeah, forget to check yeah, out my Discord, and I'll see you next time. Peace out, guys. And one more thing. Ding, 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 ding. You know what that is, Nick? Nope. That's I a bell. Get it, got it on yet? Oh, yeah, yeah I hit the bell icon. Peace out, guys. <laughs> Peace out.